Hello everyone, we are from True Maths and in this video we are going to solve question number 9th of exercise 6.3. The question says it is given that ABC and AMP are two right, ang right angle triangles right angled at B and M respectively. You have to prove that triangle ABC is similar to triangle AMP and then in the second part you have to prove that their corresponding sides are also in proportion means the ratio between these two sides are equal. Now in the first part you have to prove that ABC triangle is similar to triangle AMP and we know that if you want to prove that two triangles are similar in that case you need to prove that two angles of this triangle are equal to two angles of this triangle. And if you are able to prove that, then this triangle will be similar to this triangle. Now, ABC is basically this one. A, B, C. This triangle. Okay, the first triangle is this. A, B, C. This one. And you, need, uh, you have to prove that this ABC triangle is similar to this triangle. A, P, M. And if you want to prove these two triangles as similar, you need to prove that two angles of one triangle is similar to two angles of the other triangle. For that, in this triangle, AMP, this angle is same for this triangle, ABC. This angle A is same for both the triangles. This angle A is common here. So, we can say that in triangle, in triangle ABC and triangle AMP, angle A is equal to angle A. Angle A of this triangle and angle A of this triangle are same. This is common angle. So one angle is equal in both the triangles. Now, in the next time, in the next for the next angle, if I look at this triangle, which is ABC. In this triangle, this is the perpendicular, means this angle must be of 90 degree. And similarly, for this triangle, APM, this PM is a perpendicular, means here it should be of 90 degree. So there are again two angles in both the triangles which are of 90 degree. So these two angles must also be equal here. So I can say that angle AMP, angle AMP is this one. A M P. This angle must be equal to angle C B A. This one, or you can say A B C. This angle must be equal to angle A B C. Both are right angles. Right angles means these are of ninety degrees. So in both the triangles, two angles are equal. So if two angles are equal. I can confirm that triangle ABC must be similar to triangle AMP. This I can conclude by angle angle property. So this is the first case. Now if these two triangles are similar in that case their corresponding sides must be in proportion means the ratio between their corresponding side must be equal here. So. Now, how to find corresponding sides? The best way to find the corresponding side is by angles. Means, if I am saying in triangle, in triangle ABC and in triangle, this is ACB and we have concluded that triangle ABC is similar to triangle ACB. Now, if Sorry, this is A C A M P. Sorry, this is A M P. Now, if these two triangles are similar, this is A M P. If these two triangles are similar, in that case, their corresponding the ratio between their corresponding sides must be equal. Now, how to find corresponding sides? If I consider this triangle, which is A B C, if I consider this triangle. Here, this is 90 degree and the side opposite to this must be corresponding to the next triangle here. 
in this one this is 90 degree and the side opposite to this 90 degree must be the corresponding side for this AC here. So I can say that in triangle ABC, AC is the hypotenuse opposite to 90 degree and in the second triangle, it must be again the hypotenuse which is, which is AP. Here for this triangle, this is 90 degree and the side opposite to this must be this one. Now again in this triangle, which is ABC. This is this was the common angle and the side opposite to this which is this BC. The corresponding side to this in the next triangle must be this MP because this is again the opposite side of this same angle. So here it should be MP. So these are the two. The rest side must also be in proportion which is uh, in the first triangle, uh, this is AB and in the second triangle, this is AM. So this we can conclude that if two triangles are similar, then their corresponding sides must be in proportion. Now from this, from the first two, we can conclude that the ratio between AC and AP must be equal to the ratio between BC and MP, which is same as this. This I can write that CA and this can be written as PA. This is equals to BC upon MP. So by this, we can conclude that the ratio between these two sides are equal. I hope you have understood this question properly. If you like this video, please subscribe to our channel. And if you have any problem in maths, you can directly contact to us. The phone number, the email address and the WhatsApp number is given below in the description. Thank you.